So what is up? It is Josh, back with another video, of course. And I know I've been gone for a long time. I've been gone for about two to three weeks. It's literally the same old stuff that I always say, school, the brand, work, like all that stuff be at me backed up. So I can't really make as much videos as I want to, but I'm gonna get back consistent again. And I know every time I say I'm gonna get consistent, I don't, but I promise you guys, I'm gonna be consistent again. So today we're gonna be doing a rate and subscribers fit. And low key, I didn't even think I had like enough subscribers to do something like this. But it turns out I do because obviously we have a bunch of outfits under the hashtag. And I'm gonna do one of these, I think once a month, once a month or twice a month. Cause I wanna get a good rotation in. Cause I feel like if I only do it once a month, that's only 12 rating subscribers fits in a whole year. And a year is a long time. So I might do them once to twice a month. I don't know yet, we'll find out. But you guys need to use the hashtag Death Gang right there. And that's how you enter to be in these videos, basically. Just tag me all your fit pics or whatever. And I'm just gonna scroll through and choose the best ones. So enough talking, let's hop straight into the video. So first on the list, we got Bonds Dior. And I'm pretty sure it's Bonds cause Bonds from Seven Deadly Sins. But we got Bonds Dior and for the fit, he got a calm little fit on, I'm not gonna cap. He got on a babe tee. I think that might be an Akira collab, I don't know. He's got a red North Face on, which is pretty hard. He's got black jeans to go with it, just basic black jeans. And then he's got the Zebra Yeezys on to finish off the fit. So overall, I like the fit. It's a little basic to me, but I like a lot of like loud kind of stuff, but I also like basic type of fits too. I, I don't know how to explain it, but the fit is hard definitely. I'll give the fit like a four out of five on the scale. This this fit is definitely a four out of five. I like the way he color coordinated it and I like the way the t-shirt matches with the zebras even though I don't like Yeezys like that unless it's like the 700s or something like that. But overall, I, I like the fit a lot and I, I'll give it a four out of five. So number two on the list, we have Shy's Madness. Now, overall, as soon as I looked at the fit, I looked at the background and seen the bad boys uh, little display and I seen the chains on the side of his jeans. So first off, the whole fit is a Veils fit, Veils Live. If you guys don't know who that is, they make stacked denims and hoodies and all kinds of stuff. They make good garments. So there's a full Veil Lives fit. He's got the red and yellow Veil Lives hoodie that says Veil Valley across the chest, which is lit. He's got the black Veil zipper pants that go all the way up, I'm pretty sure. There's a zipper all the way on the side of the pants, which is hard. He's got on the Yeezy boots, which I also have a pair of myself. I like those Yeezys a lot. I don't have that color though, I have the black pair. But those are hard too. And then you just got a picture of Diddy at the end with Biggie. But I really like the way that he didn't try to match too much with the fit, but it still kind of flows together if you know what I mean. Like, I don't really know how to explain it. I can tell this is like a cozy fit for him. And he probably literally just like went out to the movies or whatever to see some and he just threw this on But it just ended up as a fit pick which I kind of like so I'm gonna give him a three and a half out of five on the scale And we gonna move to the next person So next on the list we have Jaden Chin Chuck. I hope I didn't butcher that but To start off first thing I seen obviously was the V loan across the chest we Got the good V loan on no cap so villain up top i can see he doing some chains up there i peep him the cargos are minimal denims i think that's the like the snap cargos or whatever so those are cool or whatever he's got on the infrared sixes i used to have a pair of those and the way the sixes match with the villain i like it because i think that's the mexico villain i hope i didn't mess that up but i can see the hints of red in it and i guess the camo jacket is ralph lauren because that's what he tagged so overall, I mean, the fit is hard. I really like it, no cap. Um, maybe one thing I would have done different is I would have left out the camo jacket maybe, and I probably would have thrown like a black zip up over something like that, or like throw a hat on for an accessory or something like that. But that's just me. But overall on the fly scale, I'm gonna give them a four out of five because the color coordination and everything is really nice i would have just left out the camo jacket this time so next on the list we got growing pains 111 which is actually like my instagram homie or whatever so start off the fit up top 
He has this really nice jumper on that has this really nice art on it. I'm pretty sure it's a one of one because he tagged whoever made it. So I'm pretty sure it's one of one, which I really like. And that's gray and black. So then once you go to the denim, he's got some stacked black denim, which you can tell that they're stacked just from seeing like the sides and stuff, even though the exposure is not really too good. So I peeped that. And then he's got on the turbo green ones to offset the rest of the fit, which I really like. And these pictures are actually really hard. Wherever he took these at, I really like the scenery in the background and stuff, no cap. So overall, the fit, I really like it. I really like the ones. I need a pair of ones. I don't even have a pair of ones, which is really crazy. And I like how he threw the one-on-one -on -one jumper up top. So, you know, it's still, the, the outfit's still unique to him. Like, nobody else would have this kind of piece. So overall, I'm going to give it a four and a half out of five on the scale. And we are moving to the next person. So next on the list, you know, we got the gang Andre or Erd Nashadi on Instagram. And to break down the fit, up top, he has on a button up, which I think might be a jacket or it's actually just a button up shirt. But uh, I think it's either Burberry or Ralph Lauren. It kind of looks by the pattern of it. I can't really tell since he didn't tag. But moving on to the denim, you know, good denim. We got the stacked jeans on, the light blue wash. So those are really fire. And then once you get to the feet, has on the Yeezy boots, which I'm in love with. I love those Yeezy boots. So if you guys are going to put in fit picks, the Yeezy boots are automatically going to boost your fits, no lie. But he's got on the Yeezy boots on the bottom to match with up top. And low key, his hair is low key flowing with the fit too. Like that adds to it, no cap. So on the scale, I'm going to throw it a 4 out of 5 for the fit. And the background is brownish too, if you guys want to say that. Like, just the whole picture is overall a clean picture. I'm not going to lie to you. So I'm going to throw it a 4 out of 5 on the scale. And then we're going to move it to the next fit. So next on the list, we have Insane Laurent. I see what you do with that. Saint Laurent, Insane Laurent. I like that. So we have Insane Laurent. And to start off up top... He's got a white long sleeve on, and he's got a black trucker hat, my bad. And then he's got the white long sleeve on, and then he's got a red denim vest, I think, which is hand-drawn on with the Playboy bunny on the back, which is a cool aspect. I like when you have custom pieces and one out of, uh, I like when you guys have custom pieces and have one out of ones in your outfits, because that really separates y'all from everybody else, no cap. He's got on these slime green stack denims, good denim, no cap. So he's got on some slime green stack denims, which is cool. And I think those might be some Puma suede on the bottom. I'm not really sure. They look like a Puma variation of a shoe. So I'm going to say it's Puma, but don't quote me on that. Overall, the fit is lit. The shoes match with the top or the shoes match, match with the top and the hat. And then the red from the hat is matching with the vest. And then the slime green pants are kind of there to just throw you a curveball and set off the whole fit, which I can really get behind. So I'm going to throw this a three and a half out of five on the scale and we'll find out to the next fit. So for the last fit on this list, we have Moritz. I hope I didn't butcher that. But starting to break down this fit, up top, I really like this knitted jumper that he has on. I think it says underdog on it and it has like this whole academy printed on the front which is really fire no cap like I'm really trying to find some more pieces like that like some more knitted jumpers that I really like so that's pretty hard on the bottoms he's got these gray and black sweats I don't know what kind of sweats those are I know you tagged uh, Paradox Paris which is cool or whatever so he's got gray and black striped sweats on the bottom to accent with the Louis V trainers on the bottom, which are really fire. I am I really like those, I'm not gonna lie to you. And the whole fit just color coordinates really nice. Like at the top, he's got heavy black and heavy white. He's got the gray and the black at the bottom to offset. And then the shoe just has accents of all of it, heavy white, black, and gray on it. And even doing a tint of red in there, which is kind of lit. So overall on the scale, I'm gonna throw him a four out of five for this fit. And then we're just going to keep going. I hope I wasn't moving too fast through some of those fits. I just wanted to move at a decent pace so I could get everybody in and, you know, still fit a lot of people in these videos. And I'm still going to keep making a lot of these videos. So if you didn't see a fit, don't be discouraged or anything. I literally just go through and pick the best ones that I've seen out of there. So if your fit's not in here, 
submit another Fitbit and it'll probably be in the next one, no cap. But if you made it to the end of the video, make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. I'm dropping bangers all 2020 and we finna blow this year. So just keep showing love and I'm gonna keep dropping bangers for you guys. And I appreciate you guys, thank you.